this is my Bitex um, transceiver board that I've, I'm building. Um, this is the Exciter board. Um, basically, it's just the receiver and um, the transmitter minus the power amplifier and um, switching the relays. Today I tweaked it a bit um, by um, adjusting that pot over there to give myself zero carrier. Um, I also connected this whopping great big tuning capacitor which has got three 30 picofarad sections and a built-in vernier drive. I'm not going to use this in the finished thing because it's just going to be too big to fit in my box. Um, a couple of other little modifications I made and I'll just get the schematic right here. In the audio section, just right there, that's the output, that's the mic preamp. Just in between that point and that point there, I um, basically cut the tracks and stuck an RF choke and a capacitor to ground, a 10 nanofarad, which reduced the hiss immensely. On the LM386, I stuck a I think it was a 10K and a 10 nanofarad resistor in series in between pins 5 and 8 and that resists the hiss immensely. Right now, oh yeah, I've also got this thing which is a frequency counter and dial. It tells me what I'm tuned to, for example. I think there's something more up there. No. Back to where I was. Give that a bit of volume. Pardon me while I... Sorry about that dark bit. Let's try that again, shall we? See what we got here. As you can hear, it's working immensely well. Let's turn that down a bit. Well, that's all I'm going to leave you with today. Tomorrow I'm actually going to build the um, power amplifier board. May get it on air. It depends. Knowing my luck, I probably won't. I'll probably save that for another weekend. But, I'm on the right track. See ya.